Hey guys, hope we're all doing great today. So today I wanted to do a review on this Green Beaver Cranberry Hand and Body Lotion. This lotion is made with very natural, friendly ingredients on their label here. It states that their products are free of parabens, phenoxythanol or formaldehyde releaser preservatives, artificial fragrances or dyes, phylates, petroleum or ingredients generating carcinogenic nitrosamines. So it's all very natural, good for you ingredients in this lotion here. Um, this lotion costed me $8.95. I bought it at my local health store and you get 11 ounces in this pump bottle here and literally this has lasted me like over a year and I use it every second day after I have a shower actually I just like ran out of it pretty much gone but yeah so nine dollars for an entire year of lotion for me pretty good buy the first ingredient is of course water and then there's burdock burdock root extract in it, sunflower seed oil, it has cranberry seed oil in it, carrot seed oil, all kinds of excellent oils. I'm not going to go on, there's quite a bit of ingredients, but none of them are extremely harmful for you. And it says that it's 99.59% of total ingredients are of a natural origin and 25.52% of the total ingredients are from organic farming, which is great. Of course, it's like not tested on animals or anything like that. It says Canadian cranberry, sweet fern, Labrador tea, borage, and wild carrot seed oils will nourish and moisturize your skin. Okay, so how did this perform? Um, overall, I think it's a pretty decent lotion, especially for the amount of money that you're paying for it and the amount that you get. It's it's a good buy, I would say. Um, not the best organic lotion that I've ever tried by any means but I don't think it's a bad product some of the things I didn't like about this lotion where I don't like the scent um, it is supposed to be like a cranberry scent but it smells kind of like musty to me I can't even like describe the smell it just smells like um, Kind of like plasticky cranberry, if that makes sense. It just doesn't smell great. Um, but the smell like dissipates after like 10 minutes, so whatever. I mean, it's not that bad of big of a deal for me. And also this lotion streaks. So when you put it on, it doesn't absorb into your skin right away. It will streak. I'm sure you know what I mean. But then after like two or three minutes, it goes into your skin and it's fine. But this did keep the dryness away. It did keep my body moisturized. Um, I didn't have any issues with dryness with this lotion, so it did work in terms of what lotions are supposed to do, which is moisturize your skin, right? Also, I would also like to point out that if you um, have eczema and you're trying to use this for eczema, don't because it will stain your skin. There's something in this that irritates um, any, uh, any breakage in your skin so I used it on my children who have eczema and it stung both of them they were crying and stuff so do not use this lotion if you have eczema so yeah if I were to like to rate this out of 10 I would give it like a 7 out of 10 because it wasn't like the most phenomenal awesome lotion but it was still a lotion that did the job and it was like I said the price is really good for the amount that you're getting and for how long it lasted me so yeah, I hope this review was helpful guys and I'll see you next video. Bye!